Ah, yeah. Who wants uh, to do all that? Yeah. I was impressed. I thought Holly did a great Another job. Another thing she can do. I know. You have to be very athletic. Very long list now. Uh, we're <laughs> kicking off. Kicking off. We've been getting uh, St. Patrick's Day a little early this morning. Well, yeah, probably Ireland's most famous dish. We're going to see what we've got cooking when we come back. Stick around. On the next Digital Voice, call today. Welcome back. You know what Saturday is? Saturday is the one day out of the whole year where everybody's Irish. I become Indian Irish. Indian Irish. Mm -hmm. Interesting mix. Uh, we're here to commemorate, of course, for that, St. Patrick's Day. And with us today, Todd Thrasher. Yes, that really is his name. Not his made birth up. name. Not made up. From <laughs> Eamon's, a Dublin chipper. Dublin chippa. Like yeah, chippa. <laughs> there we go. And speaking of chips, you're making fish and chips today. We are. We're making cod fresh cod from the North Atlantic, and fresh chips from Idaho. Hey, Todd, so now, are fish and chips, is this like some, is this a common meal it is, in it, Ireland? It is a common meal after you get out of the pub at night, around 12 o'clock at night. You come home from the pub after you had a few Guinness, and you have fish and chips to settle the stomach. Okay, so and fries and, and chips are french fries. Of course. Chips of course. are french fries, exactly. Let's talk about how to make them. What do you put together? Because uh, folks would love to be able to make them at home. Right, so the most important thing is start with beautiful ingredients. We get cod from the North Atlantic. And then what you want to do is you want to flour it first. We have a secret... Just flour, that's it. It's a secret recipe. Oh, okay. Uh -huh. It's a okay. secret flour blend. And then we have a batter blend, which is very secret also. We have uh -huh. a little malt vinegar. Chef is very secretive over his batter. He brought this all the way from Dublin. Yeah, actually, he's from Dublin, He right? is from Dublin, yeah. yes. Okay. From Dublin proper. Uh -huh. Now, I know y'all are... You stay busy most of the year, but is this Saturday probably the busiest day of the year for you? This Saturday and uh, two Saturdays ago, we had the... Irish St. Patrick's Day Parade down in Old Town, so that was a really busy day for us. So this Saturday, we plan to open a little early and stay open a little later on Saturday. Now, how week. long? How long with those? And you have these uh, cooking at what? I have these cooking at 350 degrees. The fish. The fish is cooking at 300, and the chips also. Fish stays in for about five or six minutes, chips for about eight minutes. And can you use some other kind of fish other than cod? Or yes, actually, right now we, we're using beautiful grouper from uh, uh -huh. the Caribbean right now. We're using okay. a beautiful grouper. Uh, we also do skate that's on the bone or on the cartilage. We have a show, one of Chef's friends. Are you going to put them in a bag? We are going to put them in a bag. Forget the bag. Just give me a Yeah, tip. you can just put those over here. Don't worry about it. <laughs> oh, After me. this segment, we will not be alone. <laughs> hey, what? Other, so, than, other than fish and chips, what other kinds of uh, really, uh, I guess, traditional Irish meals are there? Uh, well, for this weekend, actually, at Restaurant Eve, or other restaurant, mm -hmm. it's a little more upscale than uh, Eamon's, the Dublin chipper. Uh, Chef is uh, preparing a seven-course Irish tasting menu in our tasting room at Restaurant Eve. Yeah. And so uh, we're going to have brown brack, we're going to have blood pudding, corned beef and cabbage. Oh, corned beef and cabbage. Yes. Yeah, that's yeah, always good. Yes. Okay. Uh, give us some locations here. So Eamon's and Dublin Chipper is at 728 King Street in the heart of Old Town Alexander, right on the corner of King and Columbus. Mm -hmm. And then also we have um, Restaurant Eve is 110 South Pitt Street in Old Town Alexandria. You've been working hard this morning. He has yeah. been. He's working up a sweat He's this morning, it, it, I know. It's, it's only like 90 <laughs> degrees under the lights, but when you add the fryer to it, it, it gets Let's, even a little more. I know Irish aren't known to drink, uh, and Not I don't at all. want to make that yeah, generalization. Right. I'll Not at all. Else. But what do you have here so, as you put together that fish? We, you have made a so concoction good. here. I have. So upstairs from... Uh, I'll salt that if you go over here and okay. show Bob yes, how to do this. So upstairs from Eamon's Dublin Chipper, I have a 1920-style speakeasy that has no... Cool has no um, and every now signage. And the cops break in and arrest some people. The coppers have come on occasion, <laughs> but only to, only to consume. Mm. So uh, I have Eamon's cocktail here, which is a take on a traditional Irish ricky. I have Powers Irish whiskey, uh, Irish red lemonade, and on top is a little yuzu, uh, yuzu air. And that's one of the cocktails we serve upstairs. Uh, it's called PX, the okay. speakeasy. And what's this? And this is called Peppermint Patty. It smells great. Uh, it's um, a hot chocolate that I make on the bottom is a white chocolate. And Ooh, Patty, oh. not T.T.Y. No, Patty as in chef. Yes, it's yes. my ode to chef's <laughs> Peppermint Patty. Yeah. And it's on, on the bottom is a white chocolate, uh, hot chocolate with mm -hmm. peppermint infused simple syrup. On top is a dark chocolate with crushed Altoids on the top. All right. By the way, chips are awesome. Hey, Todd right. Thrasher, thanks so much. Thank you yeah, very much. Have a great weekend, too. Thank you very much. I appreciate you being We're here. We're going to check the weather and mm -hmm. see how Tony's doing. Right. Remember, it's Let Tony Try It. We'll be back on the Eyes of March. This week at Seamart from Greenwich, Connecticut, a high-end home store, earth elements, natural materials.